Yeah, welcome back. So we had partly to mostly cloudy skies. We made our way through the day today. Temperatures did reach the lower 40s out there, which is actually where we should be this time of year. We had the most sunshine in the morning, more clouds later on to the afternoon, and uh, there were just a few areas of isolated rain or snow showers today. Here's a look at our tower cam time lapse in North Platte with the sunshine in the morning and the more clouds later on to the day. But we did stay mainly dry across the region, and we're starting to clear out now into the evening. Here's a look at the high temperature across the region. We made 40 at Ogallala, 39 at Imperial and Lexington, 41 the official high at North Platte, one below our average, which is 42, but Broken Bow did reach 42 and near 40 out toward Valentine and at Thedford. Now, the clouds and a strong westerly wind did keep temperatures mild for this time of night, so we're still at 32 degrees at North Platte and Hyannis, mid-30s at Thedford, Broken Bow, Lexington, Ogallala and Imperial, and a 33 up toward Valentine. There's your wind. Now, now everybody looks like they've uh, flipped around to more of a northwesterly direction. Wind speeds right now between 10 and 15 miles per hour. Some stronger wind gusts out there. Uh, just a little bit of a wind chill in most places. Wind chill values into the uh, mid to upper 20s across uh, most locations right now. So prepare for that as you make your way outside. Here's a look at the Doppler radar. Now we do have mainly cloudy skies, especially from I-80 and points off to the south. Clear skies make your way into our northern uh, portion of our viewing area and there's still some returns of some light snow showers especially around the Hyannis area but uh, some rain showers are possible from Cambridge and points off to the south so most of us are going to stay dry but there could be a few sprinkles or some light snow showers out there as this low pressure system moves off to the east most of the moisture well off to our north we had that nice warm flow over the weekend just a little bit of a cold front making its way through. So we had the winds mainly from a northwesterly direction. We're going to get rid of that northerly component over the next couple of days. This high pressure system is going to be once again in charge of our forecast, giving us a nice southerly and westerly wind as we warm up. So temperatures will fall from where they are now into the lower 30s, back into the lower 20s for overnight lows as we clear out during the overnight. And then as we go through the day tomorrow, we're back into the mid-40s across the region, still with a good amount of sunshine. And then as we make our way through the day on Wednesday, uh, we will start off into the upper teens. So clear skies, light westerly winds, uh, the uh, dry air does cool down pretty quickly but by the afternoon we're back into the mid and maybe even some upper 40s across the region still mostly sunny skies as we go through Wednesday but that will change for Thursday so one system is exiting there's that high that's going to be in charge through midweek Another system is missing us well off to the south, but we got that northern jet stream that these lows are traveling across. This will, will drag a cold front across our viewing area Thursday, cool us down, maybe a chance of some rain or snow showers, but more high pressure is back in charge as we finish out the work week and then go through the weekend. So we're back to our sunny and mild weather pattern. Here's your forecast tonight. Partly cloudy and slightly breezy with lows in the low to mid 20s for the day tomorrow. Sunny skies, seasonal with highs into the lower to mid 40s and then and as we go through the day on Wednesday, sunny skies, still mainly dry and also still a light breeze, but that'll get us into the mid 40s, maybe even some upper 40s if we are lucky for Wednesday. Then for Thursday, partly cloudy skies, cooler, a high of 35, windy with a slight chance of some rain or snow showers. 39 for the day on Friday as we immediately start to warm up. Still lots of sunshine, mostly sunny Saturday, a high near 50. And then Sunday, partly cloudy. 45 and then Monday still mainly dry partly cloudy only putting a 10% chance of moisture there with a high staying near 45 Kent certainly nice to see this extended stretch of temperatures that are average or some cases above average yeah we were cool last week and finally we're getting into the mid to upper 40s all right thanks so much Justin and a study by the CDC shows that the majority of Americans support a ban on selling tobacco products the survey conducted in 2020